Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Hearts of Iron for using a mod called Just Cause Mod from the game series and game franchise Just Cause. Uh, we're playing as San Esperito and we're led by Salvador Mendoza. He's a dictator, very cool guy, and we actually get more weekly war support huh. from Ka Combat Calcio, so, which is not as cool, but... We're on A-Store, going to see what this mod's like, and but we're going with Viva El Presidente. Oh, there's no, no description. Oh. Well, okay, I guess we're going to purge enemy factions next, which is only a 35-day focus. Sam Purge Enemy Faction Description unlocks Fan Esperanza Caramicas Decision. We get a crap ton of political power, which is very nice. Uh, Threat of Evolution. Oh. Does not have the National Spirit? ERL Freedom Fighters. And I completed within 305 days, we have a civil war. So generally we want to avoid having a civil war. Civil wars, they can be cool, but uh... Oh, do we actually have some here? Jose Caramicas. Oh, never mind. Germany's now in a civil war, though. But well, we don't want to be in a civil war, at least for now. Right now, we're pretty divided here. We're led by the uh, certain party here. And then, not the line has no support. We have ERL, the Ejercito Revolucionario de Liberación. And they're democratic, but we're not going with that path, probably. Uh, more political power. Corrupt cop. The boy wonder. Huh. I do not like political power. This is probably bad to do, but we'll do it anyways because we can. Just for funsies. Um, eliminate ERL? Sure, why not? San, uh, San Eliminate Earl Desk. Cool. But, oh, electronic manufacturing. But if you want to like, check out the mod for yourself, it'll be the first link in the description below. Oh, we can't do that one. Uh, continue the Mendoza Montano friendship. Eliminate San Esperito Cartels. Which actually looks pretty good. Um, I no, we have three passes. We get a lot of the Black Hand. We can do a path to the uh, Caribbean Empire, or we can join the Axis. I kind of want to do a path to the Caribbean Empire, so um, let's do eliminate the cartels. Do the best we can. Eliminate them, get rid of them. You know all the good stuff. Army defense, sure. We can do some army defense. Why not? Over here, a grand battle plan or military theorists. Well, I guess we'll go with the grand battle plan then. Or I don't really need that one no, immediately. That second Atlanta naval treaty sign, air reformer. And then generic, just just generic navy chief. Cool, very cool. And what else have we got here? Also, we have national spirits, Agarian society, which is very bad. We have the San Espirito cartels, which is very bad. We have ERL freedom fighters, which is also not very good either. So, so we need to do this one. So we got to find the guy. So we managed to capture the leader of ERL, Jose Caramicas. Unfortunately, his sister Esperanza Caramicas is still free and as dangerous as Jose himself. If we want to stop these ERL terrorists from ruining the country once and for all, we need to find uh, Esperanza and target captured ERL members. We'll offer capture rebels a way to avoid the death sentence if they tell us where uh, Kurt Hideout is. Torture Jose. Uh, he's no he knows where his sister is and soon we'll know that too. Search the villages. Some citizens of San Esperito may not like the idea of soldiers visiting and searching homes, but we will have to do that if we want to find Esperanza and stop the ERL. The we do what we must. Alright, what's next? Well, let's go ahead and do improve the San Esperito uh, infrastructure. Followed up with Esperito City University. I like more political power. Disperse industry, sure, why not? As we're trying to build some civvies, eventually some millies, and all we can really build is guns, maybe. Yeah. Basic military. Nova 9s, of course. Also, the town is recording. Ooh, we do have a cup of green tea? Peppermint? No, it's peppermint tea. Um, as well as, uh, uh, I just drew a blank in my mind. Gosh darn it, my apologies. Uh, oh, can we do this again? Yes. Interrogate him? Just keep torturing him. It's alright, happens. And, ah, City University. Pretty good. So we're at 70%, which is pretty decent. We should get this done soon, and Threat of Revolution will hopefully go away as well. By the time it's recording, though, um, only San Esperito has Focus Tree. There's also Solus down here, too. Led by Oscar Espinoza, War Profiteer. Um, what else do we have that's kind of unique around here? Um, I think there's like two or three other ones too, but I don't know where they're at. Or I could be completely wrong, so. <coughs> Excuse me. But uh, yeah, that's what we got so far in the mod. Oh, right. I kind of want an air reformer. Oh, wait. Whoops. Should have done that. There you go. Oh, increased by 30%. Search of villages. That's not bad. That's 55 days, though. Hopefully, we get more political power. My bad. I should not have done that. Whoops. 
But like I said, the mod will be the first thing in the description below. 85%. And we'll do it twice. Each one twice. Or once more at least. And uh, then we'll be done. And we're going to find Esperanza Caramicas. El Gas. Electrification of small villages. Banco Nacional. Or Army Inspection. Uh, well, Consumer Goods doesn't really help us out that much, but this doesn't help us out that much either. Go we'll Banco for now. There you go. Nice. The third research slide is always very handy to have. But then, after this one, we'll go eliminate the Earl. Get more, slightly more population. 10% more stability. Always good stuff. Look at this handsome guy, dictator. And the German Civil War has ended. Alright. German boys are back in power with a nice skull hat. France is doing something. You guys are a little democratic. Not too democratic. UK is probably going to go do the same that they've always done. What is Italy up to? Oh, Wilhelm assumes Hungarian crown. Oh. Well, okay then. Uh, arrest Esperanza Karamikas. Find out where the Esperanza is hiding. It's time to end this. Nice. And then Father San Esprito. Communism and democracy goes down. Replace dictator with Father San Esprito. We lose 5%. Build a compound, get 10% more stability and war support. Sure, why not? <clears throat> that's going to take a while, though. Ooh, Ethiopia's gone, though. But that's okay. No one really cares about Ethiopia. And we lose two of our factories. Oh. Civilian and military factories. Required. It's good, super good. Well, that kind of sucks. Now we have two, four, I guess, four divisions of 18 combat, which is pretty decent. And then two divisions of 12 combat with. with Two engineers, which is also not too bad as well. Promote General Durango. Montando Cartel Health. That's not bad. Oh, we have to be at war though. We gotta promote this guy. Way more population, I like that. Better da damage garrisons, even more population. Create the Presidential Guard. It's not bad. Volunteers. Well, I guess we probably do this one immediately if we really want to. Central Ultimatum Central America. Path of the Caribbean Empire. Well, that'd be kinda nice. Also, if we have to, I don't know, it's, it's a, a freshly made mod. So if we need to, I will use Consequence if we absolutely have to, but we'll see. We're using yeah, Consequence for making sure we get done what we really want to get done. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah, Path the Caribbean Empire. Eventually we'll do Ultimate of Central America as well, because that'd be good. We demand annexation, basically on all of those people. Army inspection, of course. Um, ooh, propaganda, promote the Pearl of the Caribbean. Improve uh, the rail network. Railway network would be nice. Ooh. Building the foundations. Industry and civilian military factories. What else we could do? An electrification of small villages. 50% more recruitable population. More factory output. Um, that stuff is all very good to do. Uh, steel would not be bad. Ooh. National defense fund. But you only do that after you focus on military stuff, right? Yeah. So there's a bunch of... Ooh. But that locks you out of here. Ooh. Get more factories though. But you have to get this one. Ooh. Uh... I probably want another research slot. I mean, I love one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight factories here. One, two, th that was eight cities there as well. Deforestation. Ooh, but we have El Gas. Scientists all agree El Gas is the best gas in the world, which we could do. Uh, but let's go look see here. Uh, battleships. I like I like battleships. So probably get to level one. Wow, for 180 days we get way more weekly stability, better fascism growth, compliance growth speed, resistance decay, weekly manpower. Uh, I suppose it's worth doing it now. So, oh, the poster wall is very nice. Very nice. Moldeo Arias Madrid agrees. Let's get to demands. We just straight up annex Panama. Anastasio Somoza Garcia agrees too. As was Teburcio Carias Andino. And Yar Ubigo agrees too. But Maximiliano Hernandez Martinez refuses. Oh no. El Salvador, but Ricardo Jimenez Oramundo agrees too. Well, that was actually really good. So, uh, it's already 1938, September 7th. I've gone done quite a few things. We've done San Espirito Militarism, Military Youth, Great the Presidential Guard, and of course we just did sent Ultimate of Central America. Now that being said, we're doing Camp Durango now, so we get the better division training time, better military leader costs, starting level of new army leaders, and starting planning skill level of new army leaders. Uh, we did a lot of stuff already. Um, new synthetic stuff is not bad either. Expand the Los Hidalgos oil fields. Uh, the Navy would be bad too. 
I don't mind this one as well. After this one, Department of Defense might not be bad either. But I do want to expand north as well as south, so... Let's go expand north first. Ooh. Oh! We, we annex them, and we get their stuff. We don't get cores, which is going to be kind of probably an issue. Military government, we're going to go civilian oversight. Uh, Policia? <clears throat> so these divisions were created from a focus, and they're pretty decent overall. Not perfect, but they're, they're decent. <coughs> With a presidential guard, of course. Infantry template number one is probably what we're going to use for p police. Thank you. Uh, template three, probably not. Brigade to infantry, probably not. Uh, template four is not bad. That does require a lot of artillery. Uh, just become all infantry for now. There you go. Are they guaranteed by America? God dang it. I might do some funky stuff so we can take them out too, but we'll see. Did we get their navy at least? No, we did not. Oh, crap. We're we supposed to take them out when we have no navy. Uh, so, yeah, that's what we've got so far. Oh, dude, okay, and guns down. Artillery's looking decent too. So. Computer machine? And for the second, ooh, look at all these bonuses we have. I love it. I get some of that. We're still building ourselves up. Stalinist victory in the Spanish Civil War. Interesting. They're very democratic by being very communist. Go figure. Um, we also have Velasco now too, economist. I want to get boy wonder to see what that's like. <coughs> but we will do expand south, and we'll see what they will do about that, which would be very nice. I don't know, I just, I want to go to war with them, but I might have to remove the cores, or remove the guarantee of independence, because it really sucks. And now, my friends, we've gone ahead and, well, might have used Khan's commands to make sure we remove uh, the guarantees here and such, but we did get Colombia, but we did get Venezuela, as you can see as well. Um, let's take a look, see, show field commanders, it's going to cost a little bit of promotion, buddy, Johannes Roberts. Oh, Roberto, as we might call him. But right now, we're going to go ahead and come on over to El Salvador and say, Hello there, senor. We want to beat you up. Can we actually beat them up? That's the real question. National sees the Polish government. All right. Well, whatever. It's almost 1939. We're going to go and do this. We have some tactical bombers. We've got some uh, fighters, but never enough of anything, really. We're beating them up. We're going to be grinding on this army at speed for quite a bit, which is nice with me. Totally fine with me. Ooh, we don't need another commander, aren't we? Yes, sir. That happy day three nights. We have El Salvador. Very nice. Up next, can we take out Venezuela? Maybe, just maybe. As we're going to expand north next, and maybe rise of the Caribbean Empire, hopefully, and then we'll get cores and all this stuff, which is actually very nice. We know it's the Caribbean Empire. Nice. Um, in the meantime, I need a new commander. Oh, they agree. Excellent. We have Haiti. We don't get the Dominican Republic. Trujillo, huh? But Cuba agrees as well. Jose Agrippino Barnett has agreed to our demands. Yay. Oh, he's defensive too. Oh, that's nice. oh boy. I don't even want to bother looking at them. Just do that. There you go. Beautiful. Oh, we need what? Oh, we need to finish these guys off too. Uh... Department of Defense? Sure, why not? We'll get a Department of Defense. That sounds pretty darn useful. We got a lot of political power. Let's go do this one so it helps uh, what, do it once again. Or, uh, increase resistance to decay speed, increase compliance growth speed, and more daily fascism growth as well. So this way, hopefully, resistance doesn't get too high. More naval stuff, even though we've got one ship. And that's okay. As long as we got one of these two, that's fine with us. Oh, Jamaica is free. Oh, okay then. Alright, well, let's see. Can we actually win here? Yes, no, maybe so. We got Camp Durango. San Espirito Militarism. That's so good. President Guard. Banco Nacional. Basic small airframes. Very, very nice. Uh, get rid of that. It's not much. But it'll do the job for now. Department of Defense. Oh, Yugoslavia's not having a good time, apparently. Special Forces, rifles for stuff. We get anti tank. We just get anti tank. Purchase anti air. Huh. Well then, uh, I do want this one too. San Espirito Security Agency. That'd be pretty nice. It goes already plus two, which is very good too. 
Very nice, very nice, very nice. Oh, propaganda two. Weekly map power goes up, which is pretty decent. Weekly war spell goes up by quite a bit. Propaganda level four is actually really nice too. There you go, nice. Oh, we have to be war for this too. Oh, should have got that before we ended the war, but whatever. Uh, what are we missing? A lot of a few trucks, not many trucks, but a few trucks. Definitely need more planes. I do want to get some cast though eventually as well. Into war, no. Into war, into, into war. Basics. Oops. We don't have. We do have a little bit of ga gas. Gas. Electronics don't doesn't really matter. Yeah. They're super basic stuff. Ship stuff, eh. We'll see. Uh, so what's after that? Is it like Mexico next, maybe, or no? I really have no idea. Oh, we're doing well in the industry, though. Seven percent with Britain. Immediate patriation. Oh, we're definitely gonna need this. Mass neutrality. There we go. The capital's down here, so boom, boom. Gonna suffer supplies, but oh well. For now, at least. And then come over here. What do we have? We did go grand battle plan. Compass heritage is not bad. I might go tip of the spear, but maybe not. Maybe proper heritage, professional armory core. We'll see. And what else? Our artillery. Yeah, that'd be great. And now we can go and do. Go. We can do this one. Oh, we can do the Dominican Republic. I forgot about that. Yep. Yeah. Uh. I think throwing all these guys on there would be probably a bad idea. Ooh. Nice. So we gotta wait for that one. We're good for police. Some more domestic industry. Well, let's go with uh focus on civilian industry. Why not? Civilian stuff. There's a bit too many divisions here in all honesty. Oh boy, hold on. force it as well. Yeah, no, putting too many divisions here is a really bad idea. Or whatever. End of League of Nations. Oh man, I should not put this many divisions here. Uh, I might need to redo the battle. Just a little bit. Yeah, I might need to redo this. Well, bad. We'll focus on civilian industry. Expand the Esperito, Esperito City University. Industrial expansion and modernize the old factories as we're waiting to do. Uh, rise of the Caribbean Empire. And here we are at everybody, in which we are doing demanding Caribbean colonies after we've done the father of the Caribbean. More political power, more recruitable population, good stuff here. But we are going to demand the Caribbean colonies from the Netherlands, the French, the Americans, and the Republic of British Antilles. So hopefully they say yes. Uh, let's see. Ah, Inshan Samaru has agreed. Alf Landon's like, heck yeah, we get Puerto Rico. Oh, Hendrix Collig Collision refuses. Oh. And Leon Bloom agrees as well. Nice. Not bad. We got some of this here too. It's 1939. Everyone's going to start going to war if they've not already probably. And what else? So we can't do Operation Just Cause. Owns Panama Canal. We're at war. Hmm. Well then. Well how about we do deforestation or uh, expand Esperito City University. So we can go to war with the Dutch. Would be probably a cool idea to do. But I don't think we can really get over there. Which kind of sucks in all honesty. Um, so you guys will leave our islands. Why don't we get Jamaica? That sounds like we should get them. Or do we want to go to war this? We take horse states 280. Well, you know what? How about instead of that? Let's... I'd rather take out Mexico. That's a lot of days away to take out Mexico. Um, we would need some... Here, let's do this too. Get some supplies running through here, which would be very, very nice. Uh, it's almost 1940, of course. Go through Mexico. Maybe we can take out the United States and call it a... Cam... Pain? No. Um, S S S R as led by Zino Zinov Zinov yeah. Born Agitator. Very nice. German Empire is looking pretty nice. Poland National Republic. Italian Yugoslavia, huh? Well this guy, Italian Yugoslavia. Pop of the other Yugoslavians. Oh, and they that guy there, huh? Well alright. 
Uh, it's almost empty. It is 1940. Well, happy 1940, everybody. And nuclear research. Uh, expand Los Hidalgos oil fields, yes. Um, we speak out against Mexico, of course, because we have to. Uh, we definitely need more uh, resources. That's definitely going to be one of our issues. We've got plenty of political power. Other than that, not much else has really happened. Regional integration? Sure, why not? Ooh. We get some more extraction, don't we? We need ex excavation level 3, though. Now we're going to grab some formation fighting. Um, supply wise, we're doing all right. You, what do you got for us? Anything? Not really. Um, oh, because they did join the Allies, so maybe go to war them would not be for the best. Mexican Republic. Well, that's not cool. Yeah. Democratically by Luis Maria Martinez. Uplands, okay. Poland declared war in Poland. The colonization of the British Empire, Poland, and uh, Poland. A bunch of fascist Polish people here. Um, we're almost doing the land auction. Only two more left. Oh, and there goes. Oh, now they're purple. Look at that. Kingdom of Livonia. Kingdom of Poland is in a personal union of the Kingdom of Livonia. Oh. So you're like under them. That's a thick Livonia. Wait, which way did they go? That's a nice flag. We can be in the Seimas. A king for our people. Restore the Commonwealth. Oh, that would make them pretty strong overall. Better if it's going to be very nice too. I just hope we can take on everyone else. Thank you by Mexican posturing. And we are done with expanded oil fields. Let's uh, uh, purchase Mako rocket launchers. Why not? Now we're not suffering from any supply loss, which is actually really good. Um, we got nothing else there as well. What else do we need? Support equipment, average equipment, trucks, and whatnot. So how many more days do we have left? We're halfway done. That's not bad. Uh, so we need to build some roads. Build all these roads up. Ooh, and we can also build more roads here. But we'll see what we can do against Mexico. Just because... I don't know how far we'll get. Maybe we'll get far, maybe we won't. We do have a whole navy of uh, three ships. Better than nothing. Well, it's basically nothing. Um, then down here, generic armor. We don't really have any of these. Black Hand High Command. Black Hand High Command. Or Black Hand High Command. It's not bad. Uh, any of that stuff doesn't really help us out. So, yeah. How are the planes looking as well? Can we actually make any planes? No, we really can't. It's kind of unfortunate. Because we got no supply. No resources. So, for now, we'll trade away what we need. There you go. It hurts our capacity to build things, but... At least we can make things. Now. Be very nice. Let's start making some planes. Good. Good. Better. Very nice. <clears throat> but after the mo rocket launchers, new equipment. So we can't do anything on the right side here. Uh, railway network. Oh, we can use resources there, yeah. Oh, we can promote the Pearl of the Caribbean. It's only 35 day focus, yeah. Well, why not? Blue Grey joins sister powers, why not? Oh, Germany under attack. Ooh. Advanced machine tools? Well, we can never make those. Go ahead. Advanced machine tools are nice, too. Uh, for you. Yeah, why not? People's Republic of Atlas. Oh, this is where they're Medici. They're dictators. Now, only our nation here has content for now, but it'll change in the future. So, Germany's under attack? Oh, they are fighting these, these guys. The Corfu Cooperative. Well, good luck. Well, since we're here, send them all to Mexico. Petal of the Caribbean. Hey, the birth of them. All right. Through the railway network. That is actually relatively strong. All this over here, the Polish Lithuanian Commonwealth. Look at this guy inside. Mandaugus the third. Interesting. Hungarian society, it's not good. Competent military is not bad. State media, King's Guard, Allied Investments. Nice. Ah, we go to war too. If we really want to. Which we probably do. Actually, we should have yeah, cores on you guys as well. So let's go and save. <clears throat> this is probably gonna be a terrible, terrible, terrible idea for us to try to invade. Mexico, but we won't do it anyways. 
or any of the allied nation. No, no. Wait. Oh! The allies are gone! Can we do anything here? Hope we can. Infrastructure does suck. Our supplies do suck here. Hope we can push through here as we can push through here. That's my biggest hope. If not, we'll do some lucky stuff too. Yeah, we're gonna lose a lot of guys doing this. But I got plenty of manpower though. We got plenty of manpower. Ooh, actually. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead if you can. Come on, get in there before they all oh, or something get in there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You should be able to get to there. You should be able to get to there too. Don't let any of them leave. Now you should all just do general attacks. Either you win here or here. Either one doesn't really matter to me, because that's a big old bottleneck, and we don't like these big old bottlenecks. So either win here or here or here or there. You've got options. I think it's going to cost us a lot, but whatever. Oh, yes. And uh, Maria Doros uh, still works, yeah. Nice. What do we have over here? Uh, propaganda is not bad. Weekly manpower is not bad. Uh, weekly speed. Ooh, more breakthrough. We could use that really quite a bit right now. Let's do both. Oh, uh, you know what? Let's do all three. Um, anything else? Expand iron mines in Cuba. Oh, we need empty poster slots. Hey, we got these guys. Good. Oh, come on, right there. Oh, he's slowly expanding. We love it. Because eventually I want to make these guys even thicker if possible, too. Hey, an encirclement. Four divisions. Not bad. That's a very bloody way to do it like this, but I'm okay with it for now. Obviously. Good. We'll slowly get there. And, oh, what would you look at that? Surrounded, defeated, getting become, becoming defeated, and dying. Italy sent support. Italians want sports in a war effort to set some equipment to rather small shipment, but the NDA accept, is accepted. Gladly accepted. I want to, uh, to the, we, ooh, we need more already pieces. Guadalajara, yes. Terrible way to win the wars, but still a way to win them. Nineteen forties. Uh, I think we could probably recon on these guys. Oh, Mexico City, yes. Doctor, nice. Hey, and segment. So we've lost almost two hundred thousand. They've lost less than that, but oh, they banished the royal family, huh? Well, how about you build some new military bases and get extraction through? Nice. I have thirteen more divisions encircled. Nice. We've almost got them, and they're going to just about surpass our casualty, which is going to be beautiful. Good, they surpassed us already. Beautiful. We might have a smaller or, or I guess a bigger navy now. Wow. We have like triple the size of our fleet. Go figure. Alright, so that's a case. These guys still have to be connected. You guys go up there. We go up there too. Nice. And uh, special forces we could. How about new equipment for police? We'll do that one too. Way more already is needed. Yeah, I need some of that. There we go too. There we 
There you go. Have fun with it. Good job. We got like less than 500 guns. Get some a little bit more fuel. Not bad. Oh no, no ships. What you talking about, man? Well, I guess technically we should probably uh put three divisions or two. That's what we really wanted in the end. So we made these guys like huge. I'm gonna make them more, we'll just have more. Overall. Arm the nation, why not? Six military factories. Sounds pretty decent to me. Uh, how many divisions do they have? Two million manpower. Oh, they'll have quite a bit. How many way more guns? Nice, keep building everything up. That's good. the formalizing alliance, that's not ideal. Overall not bad. Radar, yeah, get some more out oh, output, yep. After that one, I'll definitely get some more construction speed. <clears throat> Which is very nice too. That's not good, that's not good. Trucks. On the nation, French Soviet pack, not bad. Research weapons, anti air deforestation. Uh, group Los Hidalgo's infrastructure? Sure, why not? So right now, we have a, not that much there. Could we beat them up? I kind of honestly really doubt it. We'll see. Yeah, just kind of stay home for now. Uh... Austria Hungary reformed. It's a very weird just cause world. Uh wow. That's weird. So, okay, and then it's a little weird. Italian Yugoslavia is looking very weird. Bulgaria's looking very weird as well, but whatever. And it's looking alright so far. synthetic rubber, new rivals for the army? Sure, why not? I don't know if we could actually really take these guys on, truth be told. Um, still lacking a crap ton of that. Those are, as well as artillery pieces. Which is not ideal. Guangxi clique? Well, we could try it. The worst thing we do is we all die. Oh no, oh they do very superiority too. Talk about Belgium, so. Uh, we're losing here and there, we're winning in some places as well. Not great in some of these places, but you know, whatever. What you guys have just sold? Like you, three. Go and combine. Of course, not bad. You guys go ahead. Forgot about this group here. They're slowly coming over the border. Not ideal. 21,000, 40,000. Yeah, they're slowly beating us up. San Jose.
But if we can't win and beat them like this, then we'll see what we can do in the end, as they are uh, <clears throat> totally not going to get destroyed by, like, God's commands or something like that. Yeah, totally. And totally not through the use of Khan's commands, we helped uh, defeat uh, America and uh, Canada. Yeah. And we're making an international airport, too, by the way. Uh, but, <coughs> excuse me. I think that's probably all that we have here for uh, this here campaign. It's a definitely interesting, promising mod. Uh, it's going to need some more work, I suppose, you know. More focus trees and whatnot, but eh, it's enjoyable. And I'll be honest, I've never actually played Just Cause in my own time, but... If you have, uh, please uh, leave a comment below. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.